is Rod Walton with Power Grid International, and I'm here at the Nokia booth at Distributech with Michael Torriano, who is Vice President of IoT Solutions for AT&T. We're here to talk about a team effort that AT&T is doing with Nokia. And Michael, I'd like to ask you a question here. Uh, what solution is this that AT&T and Nokia are working on, and uh, what is the feedback from utilities on this? So AT&T and Nokia announced actually last year at Distributech a relationship to bring private LTE spectrum to the utility industry. That allows the utility to build out a field area network, for example, using spectrum dedicated to the industry provided by AT&T. Okay. Um, can you elaborate on the AT&T commercial services and uh, what part of the solution and benefits that they offer with that? It's a great question. So what's unique about this solution between AT&T and Nokia is that we allow the utility to use the private spectrum but if they haven't built out the network or they need a failover, it actually rolls over to our commercial network, which is nationwide. So it gives the utility industry both a private network, but then again, access to our commercial network. And the feedback so far has been really, really strong from a value proposition perspective. Excellent. I'm also here at the Nokia booth with Kamal Balut, who is a global energy segment leader with Nokia to talk about this team effort with AT&T. And what is new about this solution, Kamal? Uh, since we announced uh, this collaboration, um, we, we had numerous engagement with uh, various utilities, uh, ecosystem partners, um, and uh, we, we came to learn quite a bit about uh, new use cases, um, where uh, what problems this solution could solve. That uh, cumulative learning allowed us to tune our solution and, and uh, make it more relevant uh, to the utility space. Uh, today, for example, we announced um, uh, the, the CPE, uh, which is going to be a critical part of, uh, of the solution. Uh, uh, the CPE is called the 7705 SAR HM. Um, uh, this product is specifically designed uh, for the utility uh, market, for utility applications. And then it, it truly uh, takes the, the heritage of uh, Nokia innovation and the transmission uh, uh, element of the utility in terms of the quality of service, security, scalability, manageability, condense it toward a small footprint uh, um, CPE that would allow to bring intelligence to the solution that we are uh, rolling out with AT&T. We're extremely proud of this uh, event today. Very good. Well, cybersecurity is a huge topic at Distributech. We, we have a whole track on defending the grid. Now, how does this solution, uh, a private LTE network, help address those concerns? That's a good question. Uh, cybersecurity is, uh, is an extremely important topic for utilities, and it's, uh, it's an element that uh, where, um, uh, depending on the use case, uh, the use case dictates the methodology to implement cybersecurity. Uh, the interesting uh, element of this solution, uh, uh, it was designed with the ability of, or, or to give utilities that proper flexibility to implement the cybersecurity strategy that is more proper to the use case that they're trying to solve. So, for example, um, uh, that cybersecurity could be uh, happening in a point-to-point -point fashion, but it could also happen on a, on a group-based uh, fashion to allow machine-to-machine -machine communication in the field without jeopardizing the integrity and the security of the system. A very, a very good uh, team effort here between AT&T and Nokia to help address cybersecurity concerns for utilities. Thank you. Thank you.